Bernard Health's mission is to be the world's most trusted advisor when it comes to helping people plan for their health care. And so we got started about 11 years ago uh, doing that. At first it was just Alex and I. Uh, our first recurring expense was, was Salesforce. We had grown from one user to 10 users to 20 users to 40 users. So you know what Salesforce was getting from us from a revenue standpoint was growing quite a bit every year. So we built really the whole company in the spirit of, okay, well, if we're going to do that, how's it going to work in Salesforce? They wanted more money every year. Right, we we're getting our annual increases. Our billing terms were changing from, I think we started monthly to quarterly, or now they wanted us to pay annually. But then they started adding and requiring that we purchase these other things that we didn't need. And so we'd have a renewal coming up, and then they'd say, oh, and we also are requiring that you buy X. Our account manager ultimately came to us and, and said, you, you can't leave. You, you can't. You all are in the, in like the top three or four percent of our users. Like the pain around moving will be will be really high. And so therefore you should pay us 18% more, not because we've done anything to improve the product or improve our customer service, but because of Wall Street. And so that's when we started evaluating and, uh, and we learned about Zoho. Zoho has very good documentation on its website on how to do a migration, which was really important for us because we had 10 years of data in our, our legacy CRM, right, in Salesforce. The main thing was making sure that the page layouts were right, that the processes were all going to be right in Zoho. And then it was as simple as downloading data out of Salesforce and uploading it into Zoho. Our estimated five-year savings is well over half a million dollars, uh, you know, saving $100,000 in, in the first year. So for us, we always think about opportunity costs. It's not like uh, Alex and I are each making $45,000 more this year. Um, it's all, it all comes into headcount for our team. And, and ultimately, now that we have a technology of our own, uh, we can use that, that money uh, to, to improve our technology for our down-end clients. Of all the Zoho products, right now we're using Zoho CRM, Zoho Campaigns, Zoho Connect, uh, and Zoho Desk. Being able to have all the information that we have in Zoho CRM, um, so our account page is, is critical. Without it, I wouldn't be able to, to do my job. And then Zoho Desk, since we use that every day for, for incoming questions, we probably have um, 40 to 50 incoming um, tickets a day, um, which is really helpful for us to be able to keep track of, okay, what are the issues that are coming up? Um, who's working on those? How quickly are we getting those resolved? Uh, making sure that we're getting timely responses back. So really all of our workflows go through Zoho and that's very helpful because if uh, any of us, there are three people on my team, is out on vacation or in a meeting or somewhere else, we are able to view everything that's coming in. It's very easy for me as a team leader to uh, prioritize the workflow. Also, our people just feel better. You know, it feels better to use Zoho. And when people say, well, how does it work better? It's a little bit hard to describe because you're just like, well, it just, it just does. I mean, Zoho Connect, to just give an example, is something that it's got a lot more functionality than what we had been used to. I'm in a, a peer group of other, of other organizations that are like ours and kind of share best practices. And about 18 months ago, um, I'd recommended, told a few of those peers that we had worked with Salesforce, and then six months later learned that three of them went ahead and moved forward with Salesforce, and 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 so it was a little little like a little anxious to tell them that oh actually we fired Salesforce, we've moved to Zoho, um, and now interestingly enough, the, those three are coming to me with the same frustrations that we have with Salesforce, and so they're wanting to more learn more and more about Zoho. Absolutely, I would I would. Uh, it's like a band-aid, you gotta rip it off, but I would definitely wholeheartedly move, move to Zoho again.